Hi, my name is Rado Alexandru Roșu, and today I'll be presenting our work called Fermuto SDR. Current not models can produce photorealistic novel view renderings. However, they don't recover the actual surface of the geometry. In our work, we propose a method to recover the accurate surface geometry together with highly detailed color. For this, we first propose to replace the hash encoding based on cubical voxels with an encoding based on the permutohedral lattices, which have an advantage of optimizing faster than the cubical voxels. We also propose a network regularization that helps recover more geometric detail. With this, we train a network to recover the STF of the geometry and another one for the color. Through volumetric rendering, we can train our model in approximately 30 minutes and render novel views in real time using sphere tracing. Our pipeline consists of two networks. The first is the SDF network, which takes points on an array, interpolates features from a multi-resolution perimeter header lattice, and uses them to regress a sign distance function. The second is a color network, which performs a similar interpolation, but from a different lattice, and outputs the color at the surface of the object. We train both networks end-to-end -end through volumetric rendering. But what exactly do we gain through the permutophilic lattice? First, we observe how a cubical lattice behaves. The 1D version is basically a line. In 2D, we have a square, and in 3D, it's a cube. We observe that a number of vertices double for each increase in dimension. This exponential scaling causes the interpolation of features to become slower and slower. In contrast, the permutophilic lattice tessellates the space in triangles in 2D and tetrahedra in 3D, scaling linearly in the number of vertices. This makes for faster optimization and better scaling at higher dimensions due to having less memory access per interpolation. One aspect we observe is that naively training our model caused the geometry to have low detail. The color network learns to explain a lot of the detail through view dependent effects or high frequency color on flat surfaces. We propose to regularize the color network by weight decay in the hash map and Lipschitz regularization of the MLP. The regularization encourages the network to gain high frequency information through the geometry instead, gaining therefore more detail at the surface. Here we show our results on the DTU dataset and compare it with instant NGP and news where we obtain more detail and better reconstructions. In this scene, previous approaches failed to accurately reconstruct geometry due to the strong specular highlights on the apple. Our method can reconstruct accurate geometry with high detail. During training, we update an occupancy grid to better guide the ray sample creation. During inference, we can use this occupancy grid to perform sphere tracing and render the scene in real time. Here we show an example of an interactive render. Our sphere tracer is dynamic and terminates the rays when they reach an acceptable distance from the surface. Since the occupancy grid is already close to the surface, most rays require few sphere traces. In this example, we use 4D interpolation to learn spatial temporal network that maps from XYZ and time to an SDF. In the video, we move through the time dimension. We observe that the network learns a smooth mapping between the input shapes. This 4D interpolation is a natural advantage of the permutohedral lattice, since we only need to access 5 positions from the hash map, instead of 16 in the case of the hypercubical voxel. In conclusion, we propose a method to recover accurate geometry and color from multi-view images. We propose a novel hash encoding based on the permutator lattice and a RGB regularization in order to encourage geometric detail. Lastly, we show that through sphere tracing, we can render scenes in real time. 
Thank you for your attention and please check our project page for more code and examples.